Hey guys, you know I love Mountain Dew, I always love Mountain Dew, but uh, today I'm going to show you what you can do with a Mountain Dew bottle and a pen knife, well, craft knife. So you just take the craft knife and you cut the top piece off. So I've done that just to save some time. There's the empty bottle. There's some Dew left in there. So uh, now we need to take this downstairs. So we're just going to ignore all my Facebook friends because I forgot to tell them I was going. So, uh, downstairs. Back onto my house. <laughs> it's kind of like cribs. This be my kitchen. This is where the magic happens, where I eat. So we just want to run the tap and give it a good rinse on the inside. As well as the cap, I want to give it all a good rinse, like so. I'll just leave this on there. Now we need a towel. So you just get everything a quick once over, rather than leaving it dry. So you just give it a quick once over. Now you're probably wondering what the hell is going on. Well, normally my mum buys me these giant packs of onion rings. I mean, these are huge things. And the thing is, if I normally I can eat them in one sitting, but depending on what I've had to eat, I can't. Um, if I leave some, they uh, they go hard and it's horrible. Got our monster monster. These are going to pretend to be our onion rings. So, just going to eat a few. No, I'm not just being greedy in front of you. I need to empty the bag a little. So there you have a bag. And then say, I don't want to eat it. There you go. Just take the bottle top. Pull. Go through the hole. So just push it in. I don't think I left much room in. Uh, yeah, I think we need to eat a few more chips. I'm not complaining. <laughs> They were much better. So we pull out the packet itself. So we have all these silver bits on the top. And then what we do is, um, can you see that? Yep. You take the lid, you just run it on the top of the paper. Screw the lid on like so until it's all tight, and there you have an air seal Mountain Dew air seal bag. So I put my crisps in there, put my crisps in there, come back later, grab my crisps, and all we do is we twist, I'll try and get this on camera, we twist the lid. Pull the paper up again, so just slide it off, and there's my crisps, all ready to eat, and still the same way as it would. So basically, what we made is an airlock bar, an airlock cap for any kind of bag. Um, we've got crisps where you could use this on. Uh, what else comes in a bag? Um, bread buns. You always lose those little funny ties at the end, or yeah, and then you have to tie it in a knot, and it still doesn't work because there's a little bit of air getting through, and you get like a little bit of green mold on the end of the bun. So there you go. You can use that. Uh, pretty cool. You can use this on um, peas if you get frozen peas in a bag. 
could use it on that, you can use it on all sorts. And uh, depending on how big the bags are, um, for instance, like, we'll go through. The reason why my freezer is in here is because they are going, the council come to redo the kitchens. So, um, I'm going here, put this light on. Um, there, see, we've got this bag of uh, sweet corn. That the bottle is probably too small, so you could get a bigger bottle, like, um, like a big bottle of Coke, like so, and just get one of them tops. And again, all you do is slice the top off and keep the cap, and it can do the exact same thing. So, yeah, Mr. Super Fan signing out. Please uh, like, sub, comment. Bye.